Hello. We're live. And welcome. Should have shut those blinds. Probably, yeah. Whatever. <laughs> welcome to the 2021 Grave Plot Film Fest Award Ceremony. I'll bet you guys thought it was going to be a lot more fancy. You probably expected a lot more pomp and circumstance. But this is what you get, because pandemic. <laughs> yeah. Things are weird right now. I mean, we it's can... been two weeks since we had the damn film festival. Yeah. And, you know, well, won't spend a lot of time explaining it, but basically we were going to do it last weekend. We were going to record another episode. No, last week. Week, two, weekend two before. Weekends, yeah. But then we got hit with snow. And, uh, no. So we were supposed to record one the day we did the, the film festival. That's what it was. Yeah, but we were so tired. Yeah. It was just, it's like anybody that was watching know that they got fucked up at one point. And so we had to. Uh, Which, of course, you know. It's it's us and technology, so <laughs> right? of course it got fucked up. So we had to fix it, and uh, yeah, this was just a, a long, trying day. Um, so we we didn't do the episode, but we we're going to make up for it the following weekend. But then we got hit with snow. Yep. So so here we are. Uh, we apologize for the lack of music or tuxedos or uh, celebrities backdrop backdrop anything um, gift bags. You know we. <laughs> whatever <laughs> flashy shit on the screen this this is the best we can do so <laughs> um yeah we're not going to take up a lot of time but we do have uh five awards uh first off we want to thank everyone who did attend the film festival uh like tony said there, there was some technical hiccups but overall uh, i think it was it was a fun show and i've gotten some compliments from various people who said that you know we made the best of a bad situation yeah so yeah, I mean, overall, like, like putting that all together and make like everything everything ran smooth on our end. It was where we were hosting the stream that got fucked up. So like our stuff ran so smooth, like fucking butter, like and butter, like, like fucking. Uh, so, uh, but yeah, I apologize for the the hiccups. Um, and yeah. Like Taylor said, thanks to everybody that uh, that virtually attended. Um, hope you all had fun. And we want to thank all our filmmakers. Of course, uh, we had films from all over the world: Spain, France, uh, not Portugal. <laughs> no, not Vietnam. Vietnam. There was nothing from Vietnam. <laughs> uh, we also want to thank our judges: Bob Foster from City of Geek and uh, Kevin Nesgoda who has written two horror novels that you should check out. You should um, check them out. And he does short stories. I used to. Hasn't he been putting some out lately? No. Thought he had. He's lazy. Okay, well, never mind. But we've got the five winners right here. Ooh. I know you're all anxiously waiting. So, um, Tony, what should we start with? Uh, the one on top. You yeah, didn't write it on the envelope, did you? <laughs> no, because I want to reuse these envelopes. <laughs> Cheap ass <laughs> for all the letters you said. Let's actually no. Let's not do that one first. Okay. Let's do the Minos Award first. Okay. Explain to people what the Minos Award. Minos is. Award is the award that is given to the most liked by the selection committee, i.e., us. <laughs> uh, Minos uh, or King Mi Minos or Minos, however you want to pronounce it, was the king. Milos. Milos <laughs> was the king of Crete. Uh, if you recall your Greek mythology, um, in dante's divine comedy uh he was uh depicted as being the the judge of the afterlife de um deciding w what level of hell people were condemned to uh by weighing their sins and weighing their soul um so he was the selection committee of hell we're the selection committee of grave plot of film hell. festival of hell. <laughs> so minus award there you go all right and uh, the nominees are everyone that was in it. Yeah, all, all of them. That's, that's how we do things here. We don't <laughs> cut it down to smaller nominees. You just If you're in it, you're up for an award. So. Fucking in it to win it. Uh, so, Tony, if you will. <clears throat> the winner of the 2021 Minus Award is Boulez. Yay! Yay! Thunderous applause. Yeah, if we had prepared for this, there'd be like, you know, probably something right here, like showing maybe a clip from the film or at least Some like laurels or something. Yeah. Put their name down here. 
Well, you know, maybe next year. <laughs> We're on a budget. <laughs> we got other shit to do. Uh, congratulations to Boulettes from Quebec. Great fishing in Quebec. Great fishing in Quebec. I hate uh, so Quebec. I, <laughs> I hate Quebec. So I think up next we're going to do the audience favorite. Um, during the show, we had a, a poll up, and people, as they were watching, could vote for their favorite of the festival. So this is that. <clears throat> Get it? Like John, like Carson? Yeah. Here's, Here's Johnny. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you got. <laughs> hey <-o! laughs> Uh, the 2021 winner of audience favorite is the gnome. Hey. hey. Uh, yeah, the gnome, our shortest entry. Yeah. A total of one minute long. One minute on the dot. Um, but uh, obviously, from the UK. Yeah. But obviously a very um, Well received. Attract, yeah, well received, attractive uh, plot, theme, et cetera, et cetera. All right, next up, we're going to have most original concept. Uh, a big thing that we pride ourselves on at the Great Plot Film Fest is kind of picking movies that maybe are a little out there. Um, something that's not, you know, just another Dracula ripoff or something. So uh, this is most original concept. <clears throat> the winner of the 2021 Most Original Award, Boulet. Hey, this is Boulet's second win, <laughs> second nomination. Congratulations again to the Boulet's team. Uh, I believe I believe Boulet is, is it's there's two T's. That I, I don't speak French. We don't uh, speak French. We so. are yeah. Uh, Boulet's <laughs> or Boulet's or however it's pronounced. I believe is meatballs. Yes, in French. Correct. Which but uh, no parlez-vous français. Merci, bleu, bleu. <laughs> uh, up next is best director. Best director. This is a big one, guys. <clears throat> the winner of the 2021 best director award is Din Tai for Make a Wish. Hey, congratulations, Din. Uh, yeah, we, we both really liked make a wish. Um, and, uh, I believe it was pretty well received with our audience as well. Mm -hmm. Um, and yeah, really well put together film. Um, great concept, good stuff. So congratulations to you and the rest of your team. Cause you know, best director, but you know, everybody knows the director supported by his crew. So it takes a village as they say. Correct. This is the big one. Best film, right here. Even though it's not on the envelope. Trust me. <laughs> okay, guys. Here it is. <clears throat> the winner of the 2021 Grave Plot Film Festival Awards Best Film is The Magpie. Yeah. Magpie was good stuff. Definitely one of my favorites of the bunch. Um, and I was very happy to see uh, that it won. Um, Another one from the UK? Yes. Yep. Um, very uh, interesting concept. Um, yeah. And uh, yeah, very, very, very well enjoyed by our, uh, like all, all of our judges and our section committee, uh, pretty much across the board, I think. Um, so congratulations to everybody that worked on the Magpie. Um, you know, hope to see more from you in the future. So that's it. Those are the winners of the 2021 Grey Plot Film Fest Awards. Uh, we will be sending out trophies to the winners. Uh, they're, they're little tombstones. And they so, might actually be, uh, are we going to personalize them this year? I, I haven't ordered them yet, so we, we can. Yeah. yeah. We don't usually because we're on a tight schedule. <laughs> yeah, we usually order them ahead of time. So we have them at the theater to show off. Right. And we have to order them before we actually know who the winners are. But this year, with everything going on, um, yeah, a little bittersweet moment. We can actually personalize the trophies. Yeah. You know what we should start doing is just have some dummy, like order some extra awards and just have them on hand. Yeah. We reuse them every year so we can personalize them. That's not a bad idea, actually. Yeah. Like they do at the Oscars or, and the Grammys. Yeah, yeah. They, have, they seriously have like 
don't know if it's just one or like maybe a dozen dummy awards that they hand out on stage and then they get mailed their personalized ones. Hmm. Good to know. Yeah. It took us three years to figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Um, we're going to go and do another episode of the Great Plot Podcast. So if, if you're a fan of that, then make sure you check us out and hope to see you next so year. So do. So do. Hope to see you next year. Hopefully back at the Arc Lodge Cinemas doing it in person. Doing it live. Yeah. All right. Until uh, next time. See you later. So long, guys. <laughs>